going on fellas uh this morning we're gonna put the fin on that truck all right so let me show you guys what's going on here fin right what you want to do here's a fin here's a here's the plastic part the wind part so what you want to do is stand the thing up and then put this on because if you lay it down and try to fit it in it's gonna be a mission so just stand it up back up a little bit stand it up and then this thing will slide right through don't do what don't do it while this thing is laying down because it's gonna take you forever so now I'm gonna put the clamps on the truck first and then put the fin on. And then of course you got your spacers which are gonna go right here. I'm gonna put it somewhere here or here. I don't know where yet. I'm gonna see how tight the fit is first. So right now I'm gonna put the clamps on. Hopefully that adhesive that we put on there works and uh it'll hold down it'll hold down the, the clamps so i'll get back to you guys as soon as i'm done with this putting on the clamps well fellas here's the fairing i painted the inside of the fairing and then uh just to put a little bit more support on it i put some bondle to it so the next thing is i'm gonna and then I, this screw I could not find, so I ended up putting another screw. So, this is the way this thing is looking. Not bad, not bad. It does have a little bigger gap, but I think it's because of that pacer, the spacer right there. I think I gotta push it up a little further. But there it is, fellas. It's black. You can't really tell that it's black because of the color of the truck. But there is a lot of space on the top compared to this side. This side doesn't have that much space, but I'm thinking it's because of the spacer. The spacer, I put it too low. So... I might have to move the spacer a little higher. That way it won't have such a big gap on the top. But at least I ain't driving with no fairing anymore. It's good to go, buddy. It is good to go. All right, fellas. Uh, hope I was able to help somebody out. Uh, the fairing cost me 122 bucks. And, of course, the plastic wing uh, was... I was able to save and uh, slide it right back on. So it's good to go. Alright fellas, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. We'll see you guys on our next one.